Welcome to the Gentleman's Guide to Gaming, and let's play XCOM by 2K Games. That's right, we've managed to get a hold of a preview copy of this game, simply because of how successful the Let's Play of Let's Play XCOM Terra from the Deep was. Uh, I know, it seems unbelievable, doesn't it? And that's because it is. This game is actually Let's Play London Underground Simulator Circle Line World of Subways 3. Uh, one of the best driving simulators currently on the market. Both the technical and playability aspects have achieved a very high standard, according to Train Sim Magazine, April 2011. I've never played a simulator before. Do you even play in simulators? I, I don't know. Uh, but apparently this third part of the popular World of Subway series puts me in the driver's cab on the iconic circle line of the London Underground. Which means I'll be taking on some of the amazing sea stock tube trains as I follow a detailed timetable. Uh, let's see, that's 54 kilometers of drivable track, uh, original virtual reproductions of 35 whole stations, dynamic passengers, let's hope they don't have any jumpers. I tell you what, just to give ourselves a bit of a challenge, let's go for rush hour, early morning, and we'll go from Edgware to Hammersmith, and we'll leave the rain as, well, the, the weather rather, as random, because we like a bit of adventure in our Let's Plays. Now, as I said, I've never played this before. I saw it at a reasonable price in a store, and I thought, you know, it would kill some time, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? So, not knowing how to how to drive a train, and most of the time I understand simulators are fairly accurate representations. My god, it is actually me! That does actually look like me from behind. How I know what I look like from behind is another question entirely. Yep, you can run then. You can run. That's alright. No running on the platform edge. So we're at Edgware Road right now. And visit London Zoo, Bleeco Kitchen. Get out of my face. I'm a train driver. I have the right to push people around. Hello. A bit early for dressing like that, isn't it? Well, clearly she's not going to work, and still fairly dark. So, we need to... Hang on, our, is that our train on the... That must be our train on the other platform, yes. Okay. So, according to the manual... And bear in mind, if I can do this, I suppose that effectively means I'm qualified as a train driver. We need to start by going into the rear cabin. Okay, and then we come over here, we put our destination light on, and we put our tail lights on. Oh, and that's those red things there. Okay, and if I go back there, aha, now I want to say that the destination we're going to is Hammersmith, and that should see me... I apparently now need to inspect the exterior of the train, make sure there's no funny goings on. We don't want some kind of uh, terrorist plot. Not that I'm joking about that kind of thing. I genuinely don't want that. Please step away from the platform edge, sir. I'm allowed to. I'm the driver. Wait! Don't jump! No! So this is all the commuters then. Look at them stupid bloody tourists. Shouldn't be catching the tube this early in the day. You'll find yourself packed in. Alright, so now we're at the front of the train. Go to the front of the train, get into the cab, switch the drive mode, done that. Turn the selector switch to auto. Is that, that selector switch? It is. Okay, well we might need to zoom in on this a bit. So, auto. Okay, we've just done that. Okay, turn the traction brake control to service application. I think that's it. Switch to the right console. Switch on the cab lights. Uh, where's that? There we are. Uh, gauge lights. Uh, destination lights. Headlights. Excellent. Ventilation. We want ventilation after all. And now apparently we want to put the heating on. Uh, 
turn the passenger light. Okay, perform a brake test. That's apparently what we need to do next. So, build up pressure first. So first we need to go over here. And we need to put that onto Rheostatic 2 and EP application. You need to come back over here, apparently, and click on, well, first, yep, the lights are, are working, so then we perform brake test. So that should come up with a yellow light, okay. So, on the left console, set the traction brake control. to uh, service application again. Well, some trains are actually on time, not mine though. And hopefully that should make a red light come on here. Yep, okay, right, that's working then. And uh, so now I need to build up pressure again by setting the uh, traction brake control back to Rio Static 2 and EP application. And now it should light up green. So, with any luck, that should be working. Best to test the brakes before we go out. Yes, it does. Okay, turn off brake test. And set destination board. So, yep, up there. Now, I know absolutely zero about trains. I've got no interest in trains. I've never driven a train. And I can't even drive a car. I won't. And I'm guessing our route is going to be... What is it? Circle line. We're, we were Edgware, Edgware, Hammersmith. So we're circle line uh, in a rail, according to the... There we go. According to the manual. Start station. Yeah, Edgware Road. Destination. Uh, we're going to walk Hammersmith. Okay, so we're at Edgware now. So, the automatic announcement has been enabled. So, now would be a good time to say... This train is ready to depart. Excellent. Please stand clear of the doors. And I'd better open the doors, I suppose, to allow people this to get on. This is Edgware Road. Change here for other circle line services. People getting on? Have they already got on? Let's presume yes. Let's close the door. Okay, and how do we drive then? Turn the selector switch to... Oh, first we need to close the right doors. Forwards, let's just quickly make sure there's... Stand clear of the doors. There we go, and... Well, that was a good choice. Okay, so we close the doors. So we now need to change the selector switch to forward. Oh, we've already done that. We then need to activate the dead man switch, like thus, and set this to shunt. And yes, we're rolling. Okay, we're rolling now. All right, now I'm going to get rid of the manual and hope for the best. Apparently it's down to slow down and up to speed up. So let's speed up because I believe we're probably a little behind time after all that fanning about. I'm sure, oh, we've got a yellow light. I'm guessing that means, yep. Yeah. Okay, no, no, it's green again, so let's go. I think I went, I, um, Come on. There we are. I'm guessing that's what these lights mean. I, I don't know. But I'm not prepared to run a red light just yet in our little simulation. So what are we on currently? We're on series. So if we go one, two, three down, we should be able to break. Oh. There's a lot of red lights on this line. Maybe, so that maybe there's a jumper, maybe there's been a fatality. I'm guessing you do you stop for these. Now, I've been on the circle line plenty of times in my life, I've, and I have to admit, sometimes the train does stop in the tunnel. I presume it's at the signal lights. Maybe there's another train in the uh, station up ahead. How do we... 
change that. At the very least, we can. Let's see. London Underground apologises for the delay on this service. Yes, we do. Because we want to know what on earth's going on. Is there no radio that will connect us back up to uh, headquarters? So we know what the holdup is? Apparently not. Guessing that it's underground, we're not going to be able to get a signal. Come on! I don't think that's uh, fair enough. I'm guessing we're not allowed to reverse. You know what, I should probably just make sure that my passengers are okay. Let's know we're not green yet. Hello, hello. Do I have any passengers? Perhaps I could get you some refreshments, maybe some volivants. Yes, I'm sorry, I know it's rush hour. You're on my train now, this is a hold-up. Oh, they're holding on. Okay, let's, let's go back to our cab. You know, it's all mod cons on this uh, circle line train. Not only to the, the, this lovely seating. Ah, oh, we're on green, we're on green. Okay. And. Um, shunt. Oh, damn, we, we did the wrong thing. The dead man's brake comes off if we get up out of the control, uh, out of the cab, as you would expect, because I think we're supposed to be holding it down. There we go, and now we're rolling. We're rolling, 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 rolling. Okay. But I... I oh, and okay, well now we're coming into another station. Alright, so at what point do I start to break? One, two, three. Four. Um, oh my god! Jesus Christ! Um, alright, we're just going to have to carry on, I think. Bloody hell, the first day on the job. Jesus. That's not what you want. I was actually genuinely shocked at that, that in, this in this train simulator... My first day, and I'm already getting people jumping out in front of me. I'm guessing that's probably why I've got some red lights up now. Oh no, we can go again now. We'll go on to shunt. Slow, slow progress here. That rumbling you can sound as us grinding up the bones beneath the train. Oh my lord, that was... You know, obviously it's not a simulator in the sense that we're going to get gore splashed across our windshield, but my, oh my. Oh, uh, is there a... Um, button for there has been a fatality. This service will be held here for a short time to even out the gaps in the service. London Underground apologises for the delay on this service. Well. I have to say, this is the worst circle line train I've ever been on. For hold-ups. That's to let someone know. There we go. Don't know whether that actually did anything. Yeah. We ride. Keep expecting mutants from Metro 2033 to get out. All right, so now we want to go one, two, three, four, and a break, break, and where are we? 
We are in Great Portland Street, and I feel like we may have undershot slightly. So let's roll forwards a bit more. Hey, this is my first day on the job, and I have already hit someone. Okay, and now we want to open the left doors. Whoops, I think I've told people this is Paddington because we missed Paddington. Well, it seems people still want to get on. I don't think I'm going to be winning many points with my boss for having missed the last stop. But you know what we could do? We could close the left-hand doors. Go forward a little way, even if we can't trick the passengers, we might be able to trick the train. No. I think we. I think we're on the wrong route. Oh dear. Um. Oh, we're, we're, we're rolling. Okay. I, I think we have programmed the wrong route into our sat nav. Oh, this is the worst journey ever. This is the worst first day of work ever. Not only do we hit a passenger, but we're actually going the wrong way. And when you're on a train, that's quite a bad thing to have happen, I would predict. Which is why we're now going at top speed. Hopefully we'll be able to catch up on ourselves. Now, what's our speed? We're currently going at 45 miles per hour. Okay, we are now at... Damn it, it goes by too fast. We're at Euston Square. This is Notting Hill Gate. No, no, it's apparently it's Notting Hill Gate. Oh, dear. This is a circle line train to Hammersmith via High Street Kensington. Yeah, sorry, you've got to make your way down the platform, I know. It's a pain, isn't it? Why are they all glowing like they're spiritual beings? Maybe they've been waiting on this platform so long that they've died. I have to say, it's far too early in the morning to be showing off your navel, young lady. We'll be having no women of easy virtue on my train. Although I may give you a ride later. Oh, damn, you're not supposed to see what's going on in here. Um... Go away. They might actually get wise to the fact that I don't have a clue what I'm doing. So, now we... Roll on. This oh, yeah. Houston Square. Change here. Well, that train got it right. Oh, nuts. Well, you know what? It could have probably gone worse. Now, from what I can tell, shunt is the slowest speed you can go at, then it's series, and then it's parallel. And currently I'm going at the fastest, because even if my passengers don't know where they're going, even if I don't know where they're going, by thunder they'll get there fast, wherever it is we're going. Let's slow down as we go around a corner, though. Alright, one, two, three, four. Um Oh no, we want to open the right doors, we don't everyone don't want everyone getting off. This is High Street Kensington. High Street Kensington? Is it High Street Kensington? No, this is King's Cross St. Pancras. And there's some very confused passengers now. Got to admire the graphical capabilities. Yes, yes, hurry up. Don't have all day. Stand clear of the doors. London Underground apologizes for the Thank you for traveling on the circle line. Okay. 
Okay, I think that's everyone on. So, I, I wouldn't be a train driver. I, the, I think that's quite clear. This was not the path that was meant for me. Alright, let's, let's rock and roll. And let's, uh, let's save the game while we're at it. How am I supposed to save? Um, ah! That sounds like a good name. Okay, I shall return momentarily. Welcome back. Now, if you can excuse the obvious buggeration that has befallen us, then I don't think we are doing too badly. I think that I have the makings of a good tube driver. Now, given that this isn't actually, as I say, this isn't a game as much as it is... Well, it's a simulation, isn't it? That's what this is. Is this exactly what a tube driver would have to do in order to get his stripes, you know, to become a qualified driver on the London Underground? Who'd want to live up there? I'm guessing those shops. One thing I will hand it hand this game is that it is it does seem to me to be photorealistic. As I say, I'm no expert on trains. Let alone the London Underground. This locomotive seems a bit too complex for my feeble mind. Yet at the same time, I, I see its charm. I, I would never really go out of my way to play a simulator as a general rule. Uh, these sorts of things aren't my idea of fun. But I think, wouldn't it be an interesting little let's play? Where's the bloody next station? Who knows, maybe we're on the right track now. I doubt it. Okay, we, we, we can, I think we can see a station. Alright, so one, two, three. Are we braking? We don't appear to be braking. Oh dear. I think we've overshot by quite a degree. I think people are getting on. This is a circle line train to Hammersmith via Victoria and Embankment. I don't... Th oh, dear. Yeah, I think people are getting onto the train. Yep, yep, it's either that or they're just stepping out onto the track and I don't even want to consider that that's a possibility. Away we go. So how about the London view? Circle line, of course, is so named because it goes round and round and round London. Inner city, mostly, although I believe there is an outer circle line. It's all part of the same track. In the past, homeless people would just buy a ticket to go on the circle line and sleep upon it during the wee hours but nowadays I believe it only runs until the small hours of the morning ah perfect stop almost or Barbican depending on your whim you're walking very close to that woman. And what? Yeah, I think he just picked her pocket. Look, it's twins. Got to pick a pocket or two, boy. Got to pick a pocket or two. Hey! One, two, three, four. 
Goodbye. Oh, I've left my door open. I'll hold on. Gotta be flung free of the... Actually, I better slow the speed down somewhat if I'm going around bends. I don't know how easy it is to derail yourself. You know, when I saw this and I saw, well, I couldn't see a northern line version of this game. I like, oh, well, why would I want to bother with it? I hope it's not up to me to change tracks at any point, because as I say, I wouldn't have any clue how to do that. I can see right up at all. Hmm. I may just go check on my passengers. <coughs> Straighten my tie, you know. Hello there. How are you all doing? Having a nice day. This is the Circle Line train. Yes, this is my train. I drive it. That's right, I'm a powerful male. I suppose I'd better get off. But if any of you need anything, I'll be right up in my cab. Got it? There's no walking backwards in this uh, simulator. Okay, so we need to take that off. Close the doors. Say... Before they can even think about doing anything else, we leave. Oh, beautiful Iris. Iris? Ibis. Isis. There we go, that's what I was doing. With. I'm blowing my whistle with, with pleasure. Ah. Oh, the life of a train driver is the life for me. I think I missed my vocation. My calling. If only I were going in the right direction, I could show to all of them, all of those doubters, that I have the makings of a good train driver. See, look at those masterful way I break. Liverpool Street, I used to get off the circle line at Liverpool Street many a time. And well, a few years ago when I used to commute. Can't see. Oh, I suppose you all want to get on, don't you? Wonder if I'll be scored at the end of this or whether this game runs indefinitely. In perpetuity. Let's, uh, let's have a seat back as we watch the goings on. It does look a lot like Liverpool Street, I'll have it into the game. Well designed. Problem is I can't really see from here what setting my... Ah, so that's the fastest in that series and that shot. Alright, let's go on series. Let's go for the happy medium. I don't know what the speed limit is down here. You know, I'm guessing there is supposed to be a certain speed. Oh, there we go. We're supposed to be travelling far slower than we actually are. We're supposed to be on 15 miles per hour, apparently. Not 20. Oh, no, there's 20. Okay. So we're good. We're good. We can keep going. Um, I think we've ju we're about to crash into a wall. What the hell? Um, uh, okay. Let's stop the train briefly. Because I'm a little unsure as to where we are, ladies and gentlemen. Um, 
apologizes for the delay on this service. We appear to be in Rilie. Or Arrakis, or that desert place in Beetlejuice. I, I can see land masses in the distance. Oh my dear. Um, welcome, all of you, to Purgatory. This is where you end up when the train you are on crashes. You are left in a desert on a train without tracks never reaching your destination let's well at least we've got some boobies oh my god I seem to be ah! you can't even kill yourself in purgatory apparently hello So what's through this door? The void. Am I brave enough to face the void? Well, one of us has got to. One of us has got to see what's out there. Ah! It's nothing but trains. Nothing but more trains. There's nowhere we can go. Oh, God. Every time I die, I keep coming back to this place. Why is there a track that leads straight into a wall? Why did I... How am I supposed to change tracks? Okay, I'm going to barricade myself in here from these... Soon they're going to become aware that this isn't London. Maybe if we speed up... So I'll take the cab again. Take the dead man's handle off. And if we go forwards... No, that's not going to happen. Okay. So what about if we go look at the select switch and which one the reverse? We want to reverse. That's it. That's it, girl. You can do it. You can go backwards. Leave this place. Leave this hell. Come on. Come on. Back into London. Back to life. Yes. Yes. We're making it! We're making it! Okay, alright, yeah. But we don't want to crash into another train, do we? No. My life, it is flashing before- Oh, God! Well, that was London Underground Simulator. World of- Yeah, I think that's me, uh, I've exited purgatory to end up in hell. So, how was that for a first attempt?